Wow, this this looks really interesting. Uh, what are we up to then? What is it? A rainbow. Okay. Mosaic. It's a mosaic. Why are we? Uh, why are you guys creating it then? <laughs> why are we making it's a so rainbow good. for our school? We're going to have it in our school forever, aren't we? So, how are we making our mosaic? Um, with chopped up pencils. With chopped up tiles and pencils. Why? Why? It's like a collage. So a collage is like lots of different little pieces stuck together and a mosaic is a special collage because it's made out of broken up ceramics, so bits like tiles and plates. So what is the stage, first stage? What did we do to begin with? Um, done the red um, stripe. Red stripe. Yeah, we marked out our drawing, didn't we? So we've got our lines for our rainbow. So we've worked out what colour the stripe's going to be. And then we went about nipping our tiles. So we've got lots of broken tiles in here. So to begin with, you put a tile or a smash bowl in a plastic bag. And with a hammer, you hammer it up and the plastic bag helps you keep all the bits in. And you have to wear goggles when you're doing that in case lots of little bits fly off and they don't get in your eyes. So that's the stage one. And then if you want even smaller pieces, you can use a nipper. So this is, these are a pair of nippers. So if you're using a nipper, then you have to hold the tile and then just nip the edge there. And that breaks it into a smaller bit. Okay, so then we make lots of little bits for the mosaic. And when you're making your stripes, it's a, I've said to the children, it's a bit like colouring in. So you have to get the straight edge of a little bit of your tile and follow your line. So that's the first step. So you go around the edge. So you use all the straight bits to follow the lines around the edge. That's a bit bendy. Cool. Cool. So we do this first. And then after you've done that bit, you add bits in the middle like this. So this is something you can do at home with your adults. If you've got some old tiles, if you've got some, we use PVA glue because this is waterproof and it will dry clear. And if you've got some broken plates or broken tiles, and then over the top, you just use a grout like you would if you were tiling the bathroom. Does, my mummy doesn't cut plates. No, if mummy doesn't cut plates yet. You don't need nippers. You can just smash the tiles in a bag, but the, this is a good bit of kit and the goggles are important. My children were using a snorkel mask, so even if you've got one of those at home, that would help. Yeah. All right, so we make it until the glue's dry yeah. and every bit, hold on Nora, every bit's filled in and then we grout over the top. That's the final bit when the glue is dry. What did you want to say, lovely baby? Um, did your children help you? They did, they did help you, help me. And it's taken no. a little while. So no, this isn't, me, you. help me. So it's taken a little while. It's not a one day job. It's something that will take a few days to complete. Look forward to coming back and seeing the final piece, <laughs> Mrs. Harvey, fantastic. Masterpiece. <laughs>